Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we would be discussing about marionette driver in selenium. For all those who are using Firefox drivers right now, we would know that we don't need external executables to run Firefox. That is because with the selenium jar itself, the Firefox driver is inbuilt. However, selenium is planning to move all its executable outside and make the jar light. So as a result, the marionette driver came into picture. Currently, it is a beta version. It is not only for the uh, automating the websites. This marionette driver can be used to automate Firefox OS 2. And Firefox is trying to move out of its add-on support and support native application. <clears throat> so moving forward, the Firefox driver won't work. For example, after 48 version and 47 version of Firefox, we won't be able to directly use Firefox driver. Even if the beta version is available for marionette, until the stable version is released for security issues, it would be preferred not to use it. So let us first see how to use the marionette driver. First we have to drive, download the driver executables. Currently it is hosted in the GitHub repository. And the latest version is 0.8.0. You can directly go ahead and download the executable and add it in your folder where you want to run it. Next let us discuss the script changes we will have to make. As we were using Firefox previously we did not have to set any environment variable because it was inbuilt with the selenium jar itself. For marionette we will have to set this property webdriver.geco.driver and point it to the executable path. If it is in the same folder you don't have to give the path. The second change would be we won't be creating the Firefox driver, we would be creating the marionette driver. Now, if you guys are using Firefox and have updated to 47th version, you will see some strange errors. Let us see it in the GitHub issues list itself. One of the persons have posted it there. So they are seeing unable to connect to the host. This is recently posted and because of this issue, uh, Firefox version 47 is currently not supported and if you come to the end they have mentioned like it is true it is difficult for them to support and they are asking us to either use Firefox 47 or 46 or move to marionette. So that is the reason why Firefox 47 is not supported currently. Now another important part to be noted in that comments is this is the point when extension signing ships in Firefox 48 or later the current selenium web driver add-on approach will not longer work and you will need to update to marionette so here also there is a big point pointing us to move to marionette rather than directly using the selenium inbuilt Firefox driver now let us try to run the script on the Firefox version 47 <coughs> if you can see I am currently using the Firefox version as 47 and when we try to run our script this is a simple script here only the Firefox driver I am creating I am going to Google and searching hello world let us try to run the code java hyphen cp selenium hello I have already compiled it so I'm just running it. I think it should be running now. Yep, it will come up and you will see that Firefox has stopped working. So this is the error you see it in Windows 10 using Firefox version 47. However, some people have reported different errors and we will be getting an exception too. Now if you want to really run it on Firefox, you have to switch to using Marionet Diver. So the changes would be, as we discussed, we would be setting the property and we would be creating a marionette driver. So as we have changed the code, let us compile it first. Java C dot Java. Yeah, the code got compiled, let us run it now. So with the change to the marionette driver, you will see that Firefox 47 starts working and we are able to do our execution in Selenium. So that is one of the reasons why we have to switch to 
marionette browser if you want to support latest versions of firefox there is no other option right now but to switch to marionette so i would personally suggest using a 46 version and wait until the stable release of marionette that is 1.0 then change all your scripts to use marionette now let us conclude what we have learned so another thing is going forward when selenium 3 would be launched they would totally move out the firefox driver out of the selenium jar so you will be again having to use marionette currently it's a beta version and it's not only for automating your website it's for automating the whole firefox os itself i hope you guys got an idea see you in the next one thank